with Josh at Zipline Gear. Load limit terminology. There's a bunch of terms uh, both on the website and on some of the hardware that talk about the limits of the gear. A couple of examples. The cable page uses uh, minimum braking strength. Uh, the turnbuckle page uses load limit. Uh, this lanyard uh, uses the term rated capacity. You'll also see KN, which is kilonewtons and one kilonewton represents 225 pounds. All of the terms fall into one of two categories. There's braking strength, or the spot that the gear fails, and there's working load. And the relationship between those two is called the safety factor. And so the safety factor, a lot of, uh, a lot of times, most of the time is about five to one, which means that the braking strength uh, of a piece of gear is five times greater than the working load. And so when you have your zip line up, and you have a 350 pound guy, and you're concerned about maxing out that, um, that maximum weight on the zip line, just remember that that 350 pounds is not maxing out the, um, the braking strength, it's still staying within the working load limits of that hardware. So some clarity on load limit terminology.